Hi, I'm Kat Weixel from Paid Group, and I have a stream tip to share with you. So if you go to stream and it looks like this, you are still set up for stream classic. Microsoft has been making a lot of changes recently, and they are really prepping to get everybody on board with stream on SharePoint and moving away from stream classic. There have been a number of announcements about this. One thing that is coming very soon is the public preview for the ability to migrate the videos that you have in Stream Classic over to Stream on SharePoint. I'm going to show you. If you are an administrator, you can go into the admin center and just start preparing yourself for this change. If you go and kind of expand the admin centers and click all admin centers, you can go into the stream admin center. And one of the areas that you should see now is this stream migration preview. Mine in my demo tenant still only has one option. It's not really showing the public preview yet um, and the option to start migrating from classic to stream on SharePoint. But you can start prepping your users if you want to by turning on this message. When people go to Stream Classic, you can either use the default message or write your own and basically start telling your users that this is going to be replaced by Stream on SharePoint and linking them to Stream on SharePoint so they can start creating and viewing the videos that are there. So all you have to do is save changes to make this happen. And let me show you what this looks like for Diego. If he comes in and goes to stream, right now he's just seeing stream classic and he's not seeing any messages about going to stream on SharePoint. So I'm going to switch back over to my administrator account and I'm going to go ahead and save these changes. I'll just use the default message. This is fine and it gives the information that we need. So I'm going to save changes. And now that this has been set, I'm going to go back and take a look at what Diego sees. So now when he comes in, he's going to start seeing this little banner across the top with that message telling him that Stream Classic is being replaced. And he's got a direct link to go to Stream on SharePoint. So you can click here or here to go in and look at that experience and see those new options, including the new option to start recording in Stream on SharePoint. So this is just a nice way to start prepping your users and getting them ready for this change. Obviously, Stream on SharePoint has already been available, especially if you are recording meetings in Teams. Those are now getting saved to OneDrive, so that's technically Stream on SharePoint already. Uh, and we're just getting ready for that next step of being able to start migrating our current videos that are stored in Stream Classic and getting them moved over to Stream on SharePoint. Once that's ready, let me go back to my admin account. You should start seeing a link to that uh, under this stream migration preview area in your admin center. So keep an eye out and we'll keep keeping you updated on stream on SharePoint.